Portugal, of course, taking to the field for the first time in this edition of the most prestigious festival in world football. No doubt looking for a performance to set a tone. There's his great vocal support. There are many, many who have travelled to watch them, and every one of those supporters willing them to give everything back for the... The imperative for everyone, three points on opening day. Well, Peter, both of these teams will take to the pitch with a three-point focus. Ambition is fresh and strong, and each will want to go deep into the competition, so neither will be looking to come out of this with a, a flawed game plan. This has to be assured and close to their best. And we're underway. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Um, Pepe may well need to be at his best. There's a power about his game, thanks to very decent pace for a big man, and he doesn't lose out much in the air either. He could prove to be a very reliable presence here. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. João Cancelo comes inside. And it's Bernardo Silva. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. And now the breakaway. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. Yazici. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out-muscled. Could move up a gear here. Looks to thread it through. And very necessary. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's Xiao Moutinho. Ronaldo throws it backwards and they'll try again. Guerrero, Cristiano Ronaldo. And that's been one straight back. He's looking to get there first. Yasichi. Good ball, it's found its target. Oh, he's got that all wrong, and it's a penalty. And that really is the last thing they wanted to do. One never any doubt. A time for a cool head, and that is precisely what he showed. Well, he took a chance, hoping that the goalkeeper would dive, and that's exactly what he did. <laughs> Turkey take the early advantage. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, managed to get it away. Joao Moutinho. And it's Yilmaz. A real chance to break. Lovely bit of skill there. Deftly done. Oh, real danger here. Chalanolu. It's anyone's ball. Pepe very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. He's made sure that that won't get through. 
Well, well played, he saw that coming. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Gets good distance on it. Bernardo Silva, Jota. Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually... Great leap! He's missed, but not by that far. Bernardo Silva certainly could have and should have made more of that. Hanolu. Over to the left. Just brushed off the ball there. That'll be a throw. And here's Chal Hanolu. Good run. Ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes able to come up with a better ball. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. Bernardo Silva plays it forward. It's in, and that looks to me very much like an own goal. It's an unusual turn of events, and it was an honest attempt to help out, and I suppose it can happen to anyone. Portugal got some help from Lady Luck there. They all count. Tries to get it forward quickly. Tufan. Midway through the first period, and it's looking quite a game here. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Bernardo <laughs> Silva tries lifting it over. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Danger averted for now. Chalhanolu, and the through ball is intercepted. In by Chalhanolu. And he has been fouled there. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket, it's just a stern lecture. Nicely done. <laughs> Turkey take the lead. Giammutinho. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Out to the left it goes. <laughs> well, there's something you don't see every day. Giammutinho. to shoot and he duly delivered yeah and I think we may have had too many defenders ball watching then because they just lost sight of the real danger <laughs> 
This is quite a battle. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. And it's Cancelo. Bernardo Silva. A heavy challenge. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. Now it's Burak Yilmaz. Burak Yilmaz really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Jota tries to get it clear. Joao Moutinho. Surely a shot. It's a loose ball. It's got through and... And through to the goalkeeper. Bruno Fernandes. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Gets up to hit it! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Plays it out to the wing. Looking to break out here. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Jota. Jota! This possibly the last play of the half. He's had a shot! Portugal and the whistle goes for half time. Oh, what a comeback! So, I didn't see that coming, nor I think with many in this crowd. So we reach the halfway point. Well, Peter, I'm just thinking of the best way to describe that frantic, um, frenzied. It was unmissable and it was irresistible. Forget about the analysis on this one, just enjoy it. Portugal to lead, but it's quite a game. Half time. 3-2. The action has already resumed here. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's on his way. Bruno Fernandes. Intervention was very necessary. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. The chances keep on coming. They're awarded another corner. Tries a header! Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. Bernardo Silva. Yazici demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Back to the keeper and try something new. Guerrero. Jota. Bruno Fernandes sticks in a foot to win it back. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. 
Well, if he truly fancies his chances from here, he's going to need the best of the best. What a save! Terrific reaction! And he's there to clear it. Under. To fan. Referee's given a throw. And it's Yilmaz. And he's going to be pulled back for that one. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Burak Yilmaz. He's gone for it! Straight at the keeper. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Soinchu. Soinchu goes looking. And it's Chalhanolu. Yazici. Chalanolu, a scorer already in the game. He's in, it's one! <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Tufan. Yasichi. Chalhanolu. Chalhanolu drives it forward. But this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. And Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. Jean Moutinho. And it's Bernardo Silva. It's a fat going for goal! And he's there to make a great save. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. So here comes the substitution. He got amongst the goals here, and now he takes his leave. Look, you can only give your all, and he's delivered in that regard, and I think the manager has probably just spotted now a little tiredness creeping in, and, you know, if that's the case, then, you know, he's doing the right thing. And the defence can get it clear. Ruben Diaz. Oh, great ball! Just... It's Cristiano Ronaldo! It's a terrific save from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Guerrero. Ronaldo is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, and having notched a goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulder as, as much as he'll want. Under can't get the better of his opposite number. Hoists it forward. And he's there to cut it out. Tufan. Forward it goes. And it's played forward. Hoists it forward. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Breaks on here, and it's Chalhanolu. Bernardo Silva. Done very well to intervene.
And it's Chalhanolu. It'll be a throw in. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Turkey are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Danilo Pereira. Jota. Bruno Fernandes. Jota. Jao Cancelo. Rafa Silva. Jota! And it's hoisted clear. Portugal are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. And there. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And he's there to hoof it away. Bruno Fernandes gets wrestled off the ball. Portugal probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. He'll hit it! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. That's a foul. No two ways about it. <laughs> Guerrero. Almost there, and the players can feel it. And he's cut it out. Gets good distance on it. Loose. Jota, now can he finish? And the shot! Oh, taken with style! And there's the goal they've been looking for. Portugal are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's the clever use of counter-attacking. That's the real highlight. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. <laughs> Portugal could not have picked a better time to snatch a two goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Yeah, looks very much like the final nail in the coffin for me, I have to say. The referee has seen enough.